What is up, my fellow Arkham Race? Me, Gorgon Three, and welcome to Final Fantasy Dolmos Two Remastered. It doesn't say it in the title, but uh, this game actually was made a while ago, and it was meant to be the sequel for the five first Final Fantasy Dolmos, but it was actually remade because apparently the um, the first game got a, like the second game got a lot of hate, and like nobody likes it apparently, and so it's been brought back, and here it is right now. So, I'm actually pretty excited to get into this, even though I've never played the original. I've actually only played Final Fantasy Dolmos 4, tried Final Fantasy Dolmos 3, and I'm going to be playing this now. Robosmith LLC, after the incidents in the new Dolmos restaurant where an angry crowd entered, they still closed the establishment. Robosmith is searching for a security guard. Job working the night shift, 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. Guard is equipped with a care panel, and an office room is built with three metallic doors. $1,200 a month. Not a bad pay. Although, probably not a good pay at all, actually. You never know. I mean, I don't really know. <laughs> anyway, let's see what this game's all about. So, oh, we got a huge cursor right here. Oh, it's this location vibe I see. What's this? Nothing? Can you conk your nose? Nope, I guess not. Can I turn this? I guess not. So, this is basically the recre this is basically a recreation of the elevator scene in the Five Nights Freddy's Sis location. Pretty nice, actually. I mean, it's not much of a recreation because it's just like a fan made version. I mean, it is a recreation, but it's in a fan game. Uh, can I crawl through the vent? Probably not a good idea, actually. Can I do anything? Can I still honk your. I guess not. Should I go through there? Should I just wait? Oh. Night one. Alright. Should I. Do I click on the door? Do I, oh, okay. Let's go through there, I guess. Why not? Um, gear. It's not rotating. It should probably be rotating so that it indicates um, the loading and it's not responding either. Please respond, I need to play this game. Oh. Oh, already, I guess. Alright, press the spacebar for tooling the camera panel. Use the arrows at the side of the screen for moving. Wait, what? I, can, I can't see anything. Welcome to your first what, why is it? week of your first week at Robo's Week. A company specializes in... There's not a lot of cameras. What the heck is that thing? Is that a Ballora Rip over the corridors? Why does it keep doing that? Uh, can you not keep doing that, please? Oops, I did not mean to do that. Well, that's a kind of a cool thing, actually, to be able to pull up the cameras well. Oh, can I use the arrow keys, too? Or... This is your job. I, I guess... I guess not. Um, can I... How do I activate the lights here, though? Is there a button for that? Why do the lights keep flickering? Oh, it's right here. Alright. So I don't think I can... Don't think you can... So just to get shut the door... Uh, oh, why does it keep doing that? I'm just gonna ignore the phone guy for now. It's probably not a good idea to hang up on him. Because in Dormant Tabis, you kill the... Would you stop doing that? Thank you. Is, there must be lots of movement going on right now. Thing is, I can barely see where the animatronics would come from. Unless it's like a sound cue that would play. I mean, that could be like... Like, I'm just trying to find out if I should use my thumb. Or if I... If for like the left click button, which I use literally all the time. Or if I should just, um... I don't know, be a normal person to use it, you know? I was already 130, by the way. Am I gonna die soon? And the phone guy... Oh, that's not a good sign. Uh, movement detected. Alright, well that's just wonderful then. Um... Is... From, from, from where? I mean, this, this game is pretty soundy, at least. So does that mean I'm gonna know when an animatronic is actually in the door? I mean, that would be... I don't see anything, actually. So... Okay, that was already glitched that occurred. What the heck is that over there? Okay, I can't tell what is going on at all. What's over here? Uh, what's over there? Nothing. Okay, predictable. Uh, what's... What, what about over here? This, this, just, this just seems to be the same stuff over and over again. And it said movement detected, but I don't know where they could possibly be. 
But I'm pretty sure at around 3 a.m. they're gonna start coming to buy and saying hello to me. Hopefully. Hopefully they're not- Oh, that's not- that's also not good. Movement detected from where? I think this is like the only kind of camera I'm supposed to really be using, so... Am I supposed to be concerned right now? Or am I just supposed to be chill like I usually am? I feel like I should be panicking and- Oh, okay. Just, can you just stop doing that, please? Thank you. What was that? I heard footstep noises. Oh, wait a minute. Is that- was that- was that something? I- I feel like- I feel like there would be audio cues that would indicate when an animatronic would be nearby. I don't know if there is, though. And I feel like this- this facility has an infinite amount of power, too, so... I guess I shouldn't be afraid to use them? I don't know- I don't know. If I die at about 5 a.m., I'm not gonna be- Did you just- Oh! Okay, that was that was something. And was that this was that them leaving? I better hope so. What? Oh, I have to hold the door down. That's what I have to do. Oh. Okay, it left. Oh, I get what I have to do now. I have to literally leave the door shut. Until one of them leaves. That's what I have to do. Alright, I understand, game. So, that would have easily made me angry. You know, mad. You know, mad. Oh, crap. I mean, they seem to be relatively calm tonight, so I don't think there's much to. Okay, that was a first. Anything? Anything new? Yeah, that's actual movement in the cameras happening right now, so that- that's not- oh, crap. Oh, alright, I did it! If that thing would've killed me as soon as 6am hit, that- that would've not been the best thing to do- to happen, actually. But, we reached 6am. Those are interesting noises that are happening right now. Alright, um, is there gonna be any mini-games or any cutscenes? Voice acting? Oh. Oh, well, I was right about the mini game part. Any story, any dialogue? We're just having a conversation with the purple guy. That says wah. <laughs> Why does it say wah? Can I move? Hello? Oh, my, my, my computer just freaked out. Alright. Uh, Mr. Afton, I would like to hire you for my designing and construction of my, my new set of robots. Um, after the incident which happened in my last location, I won't safe. I won't. I want safety ro safety robots to be in the upcoming Doma's Grand Circus. I'll be glad to help you with the design of the new robots. I need a brief description of those characters in a week or so. I will have the blueprints ready for the models. I will call you then. Ah, uh, thank you, Mr. Action. Afton, it is a pleasure. All right. Well, that just happened, and now we're just fading to blackness. So, they're basically trying to find new designs for the animatronics. And as far as I know, that's all of the that's all of this game is about. Well, that's probably not all this game's about, but I have to go through this stupid elevator sequence again. It's probably gonna be different, though, each time. But can I still honk your nose, and why do you look so disturbingly creepy? Just, just wondering. Anything new with you, phone guy? I doubt it. I seriously do, and I'm sorry to say that. Shut up! Shut up! Shoop. Shut up! Whoopie doop. Swiftly swaffle. Welcome to your second night. Time flies, right? I guess so. I hope you enjoy your first night with us. There are so many matronics stored in this facility which can be seen in the camera feed. That's the case of two small robots called Mini Labs. The Mini Labs have never been very calm, so if you see them near your office, don't let them enter into your room. They are too small for attacking or harming you. But they can mess up the electronics, disabling the panels. These two robots are equipped with a laughing device. This may make easier to detect them since you can see them in the camera feed. Also, take a peek from time to time to Circus Laura. That might make her move less. Who knows? That's all. Have a nice day. Wait. Good night. This one? 
No, that doesn't do anything. Oh, hello. Wait, what? What the heck is that? Oh, what is all that noise? I don't like all that flippity flippity noise. Alright, did it, yay! So, let's just see what the next cutscene is all about. Oh, we're in a bedroom. This is, this reminds me of Five Stoles 4 in a way. He's sitting on a chair, I guess. So why not? Chairs are cool. And life is cool. Finally, the blueprint for Dolma has arrived, designed by William Afton. Okay. Uh, motion sensors. De it's 270 degree ro rotating waist. Uh, articul articulable joints. Um, 440 pounds for a skinny animatronic like that. And it's 6.2 feet high. And it's named Dolma. Designed by everybody lovely and laughed How dangerous does that look, kids? Oh. That's it, I guess. Okay, well, we got the blueprint for one of the animatronics. So exactly what are these animatronics that we're actually dealing with throughout these nights? I think I'm actually going to leave it here because I kind of want to see um, if I can like set a like goal for this. I don't like setting like goals for um, these kinds of videos, but get this video to 20 likes and I will definitely do a uh, part 2 of this because this game is pretty interesting so far. But I don't see the point of like playing through like a bunch of nights and seeing what happens. But, you know, let's see what happens. So yeah, thank you all so much for watching, and until next time, ladies and gentlemen, stay awesome! Hey guys, I just want to say thank you all so much for watching this video. Your support honestly means everything to me. And I would just also like to inform you that I have a Twitter, an Instagram, a Discord server, an Ask of Them page, DeviantArt, and I also have a second channel which I use for reaction videos. If you want to go check those out, links are in the description down below if you want to go support them. Follow me on Twitter if you want the latest news or on my Discord server of what's been what's what's going to be happening on this community. And I'd also appreciate if you could maybe go check out these videos over there and maybe you could click that subscribe button and leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it. That is pretty much all that I have to say. Like I said, thank you all so much for the support. It honestly means everything to me. And that is it for this video. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, stay awesome.